So in this video, I'm going to show you how to get rid of the contacts from showing up on the display on your Echo Show. Because if you have the Echo Show or the Echo Show 5, you might not want your contacts to be so easily accessible. So with the Echo Show and the Echo Show 5, there's no way to block your contacts from showing up on the display. There's nothing in the settings you can do to change that or to prevent anybody else you know friends neighbors that comes over your house and go in there and see your contacts but there is a way to prevent it from displaying on the screen and that has to be done through the app so let's go to the procedure of turning off that feature so your contacts won't be easily accessible through the display on your echo show or the echo show 5. so before we turn off that feature let me show you exactly what i'm talking about with this quick demo so the first thing you want to do is swipe from the right and you want to go to communicate on the communicate is where you find the drop in announcement calls messages and show contacts now once you click on show contacts it's going to actually display all your contacts so for privacy reason you might not want your contacts to be so easily available so let me show you how to go into the app for your Echo device and change that. So the first thing you want to do is go over to the three lines in the top left corner. Then you want to go down to contacts. Now once you get to the contacts page, it's going to show you all the contacts that is pulling in from your phone. The next thing you want to do is go to the three dots in the top right corner. This is going to bring it to the page that says manage contacts. From here you can add, block, or import contacts. And if you notice right below the import contact, it says enable. So if I click on that, you'll see that it's actually enabled. So it's going to periodically update and upload those contacts to the Amazon cloud, which in turn make it shows up on any one of the Amazon Echo devices that have a display. But unlike your phone where you can lock with a pin or a password or even your face ID, the Amazon Echo Show or Echo Show 5 doesn't have any kind of feature like that. And if privacy is an issue for your contacts, then you're very exposed by having them display on your Echo Show or your Echo Show 5. So all you have to do now is just turn this off. Of course, it's going to say that you are disabling the contacts from being imported, which is fine. That's what you're trying to do. Now let's look at what it's actually saying. It says the contacts imported from your device address book will be deleted. Now it's not deleting the contacts from your address book. It's only deleting it from the Amazon cloud. So your contact stays on the phone until you manually go in there and delete them yourself. So once you confirm that's what you want to do, you want to click OK. And now that feature is off. So if I go back and as you can see now, it says import contacts is disabled. So it's not going to import any more contacts until I go back in there in the future sometime and manually turn this on, which in turn prevent it from showing up on your Echo Show and your Echo Show 5. Maybe sometime in the future, Amazon will come up with some type of security measure that will prevent your contact from so easily available display on the Echo Show and the Echo Show 5. But until then, if privacy is an issue for your contacts, then you need to go into the app and turn this off. Okay, so now let's go back on the contacts on this device to see what's actually displaying now. So you go back to communicate and then let's show all contacts. So as you can see now that it's disabled, the only contact is showing is your own. Okay, so I hope that was helpful to you if you were looking for a way to turn off those contacts from showing up on your Echo Show 5 and your Echo Show. Okay, so that's going to be it for this video. If you enjoyed it, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. I like making these kind of videos to just show people the things they can do with the Echo Show device, smart home, and all kind of different stuff. So I want to thank you for taking the time for watching this video. I look forward to see you next time. Have a good one.